Hey, want to laugh? This is a show about two friends who navigate the comedy scene together. Completely non-sexual, of course. And they're going to watch a couple videos and make you giggle. This is the Bryson Sci-Fi Show. Take it to the chorus! I think go ahead, true. girl. <laughs> go ahead, we ain't going with it. Take it to the back. And then mm-hmm. we ain't going with it. VIP. Go ahead, we ain't going with it. Drinks on me. Go hey. ahead, we ain't going. We'll be working with. Go ahead, we ain't going with it. Go move those hips. Go ahead, we ain't going with it. Something, something. Go ahead, we ain't going with it. Make you smile. <laughs> go ahead, child. Go ahead, we ain't going with it. <laughs> Who's six lips? Oh, does he say that? Like, who's your sexy lips? No, no. I'm sorry. Just expose yourself. Um, I don't. I don't listen to a lot of Justin Timberlake. But who's the other guy? In the, I can't think. Robin Thicke. Robin Thicke was he, dope. He was hot for like one year. Uh, I, year. no, he was he was hotter over. The, but the people like year. knew him, but I didn't. know He was him. hotter over the full year. I only heard him from. Scoot that over this way a little bit. Just a t. Yeah. We yeah, be touching. I, I want us to be touching. You want to touch? <laughs> elbows to elbows. <laughs> Maybe a little more. I don't know. <laughs> Give me some bow kisses. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I gotta stop fucking shit. Dom is always yelling at me. I, I never yell. <laughs> yeah, right. Yeah, we're not allowed to say what we're thinking. Dude, right we're now. fucking Zen brothers. What are you talking about? Dude. Y'all living in Zenny Zen Zen. Go and put that there. <laughs> we getting sponsored by mm-hmm. Zen now. Two cans, Sam. That's what I call them. Ooh, mm-hmm. two cans. I said every time I'm at the gas station, I get a laugh every four or five times. <laughs> 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 it's not that many. <laughs> it's not that good of a joke. I see. <laughs> He's like, it rarely they works. They call me Two Cans Sam. It works. N- nothing. Fucking nothing. I laughed. I, I think it's. Well, I guess they're good. also not from America, so. There's a chance <laughs> that they don't know who that is. You're speaking to people. Like, who you're the doing fuck's jokes to people. Sam? What the hell are you English ain't about? their first accent. Yeah, probably being racist. Accent. Maybe. You know what's funny? Hmm. I've uh, I've gone through, I've gone through a, all of our episodes recently. Yes. Mm-hmm. And I just want y'all to know we might be the stupidest podcast out there. That's, Why do you say that's that? The point. Well, I disagree. One, the things that we talk about. <laughs> Two, going back, we misuse words. A lot, <laughs> like a whole lot, like a whole lot. Like, uh, I one of the ones I was focused on. I said impersonation instead of impressions. That's not that crazy. Yeah, but impersonation is you pretending to be someone, like breaking the law, versus an impression. True, I guess. But That's the best thing is, every time I've noted that we were misusing a word. Nobody corrected the other. We were all just like, yep, mm-hmm, that's true. Yeah, we got it. <laughs> He's saying the right thing. Keep it moving. This podcast is the blind leading the blind. It really is. The blind. We're some of the dumbest people you meet, but we have a good time. Hell yeah. Oh, it's a great time every time. Yeah. Sometimes. Hell yeah. Yeah. Well, fuck it. I mean, what is English anyway? <laughs> <laughs> true. <laughs> Come on. Yeah. What is it? Your visa's never going to come in. This <laughs> is getting deported so fast. <laughs> did 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 deport them? That's that real Jamaican shit I, right there. Really? I really need this podcast to hit. <laughs> <laughs> it's my proof of citizenship. <laughs> yeah. When my family writes me <laughs> and asks me to send rice home. Oh, yeah. And I just keep sending them links to episodes. <laughs> <laughs> How was y'all's week? I'm unemployed again. Oh, what? Damn. Yeah. What, what happened? I uh, just had a temporary job. Oh, uh, contract okay. engine. But, you, yeah. You know on here that we never said you were reemployed because those episodes didn't come out. Oh, really? So people just thought you were unemployed this whole time. I got a job <laughs> and then I lost it. So. <laughs> and it's gone. There we go. <laughs> it's not going so bad though. I like I like being unemployed for a little bit. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Everybody should be unemployed for a second. Just I to, agree. Just to be out there in the world, you know. <laughs> I feel it. Have you heard of this thing? Um, I just found out about it. It's, I think they're called NIMS or NINS or something like that. It's people who refuse to work. Mm. <laughs> Nicole, Can you look it up for me? Uh, it's, Is that word he doesn't know? It's, a, it's, a, <laughs> Google no, that? it's a people. Just type in people who refuse to work. Well, that's going to be something racist. It's going to be racist as fuck. It just starts showing different groups of people, <laughs> like ethnicities. It's number two. Yeah. Uh, it's a term for them. It's a... Uh, type in Gen Z with it, because that's what, that's what they really love to... Uh, 
attach things to. They'll put it with a certain yeah. neat. neat. Yeah, see, as soon as you put it with a certain uh, <laughs> employee generation, education or training. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I'm yeah. not even mastering martial arts either. Yeah. It's, it's people who wake up and go, "I'm not doing a motherfucking thing." Kiss Man. my ass. That's kind of cool. But that sucks. Too. <laughs> yes, you should see him on YouTube. I went through a whole TikTok and YouTube wormhole finding out about these motherfuckers. Damn. And I bet they cut it off right before they start getting paid too. <laughs> no, <laughs> like, no, that's a job. Technically, hey, hey, hey. You better cut this shit off. Well, no, they so they never have more than like one or two videos. Oh, yeah. I, it was just different channels. <laughs> they're lazy. Yeah, they, yeah. It, it's wild. They'll tell you they're like, bro, I escaped the matrix. I'm not paying for you guys. Pay to live. I'm living in my mom's attic. <laughs> and he's like, bro, you yeah. did not figure shit out. You're a dumbass. <laughs> Y'all stupid. <laughs> Then you do have some people who are like, I used to be about that neat life, but bro, I'm just a bum. <laughs> like they start <laughs> coming to these realizations. One dude was like, I got tired of just leeching off of everybody. Nobody liked me. Yeah. I was like, I bet they got to be super young. Oh yeah, they're all they super be young. like 21 max. Well, it's oh, it's a Gen Z thing. Oh right. Mm. See, that's what I was saying, man. True. You gotta. I don't know what it is. I felt like the internet was acting weird. It was like. I don't know who you're talking about. Who doesn't want to work? There's a bunch of people who don't work, want to work. you talking Gen Z? Those lazy fucks? <laughs> those neats? <laughs> never heard that. What yeah. a lame name, too. Yeah, I know. Who came up with that? Y'all have no job. Come up with a better <laughs> name, bro. You have time to be creative? You got all the time in the world. Yeah. Come on. That's a stupid name. Quit dicking around. I guarantee they're not neat. Yeah. By the way, messes. I'm not training either. That part's hilarious. Mom, I'm going to take this Doritos bag and throw it on the ground. Not picking it up. <laughs> Might even shit in it while I'm here. And I'm gonna call it being neat too. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Didn't neat. even make my bed, mom. <laughs> I stayed up till 4 a.m. Okay, you're describing me, but <laughs> I'm looking for a job, and I'm definitely training. Yeah. Always training. See, see, see. You're not a neat. You just, uh, you just a nigga working, bro. <laughs> too old to be a neat. Yeah, you too old to be a neat. <laughs> At what age is it no longer a neat and it's just like, hey, dog, <laughs> you a bum? Get your shit together. <laughs> this shit ain't even cute. Fuck. What about you, Dom? How was your week? I was good. We shot the Brandon uh, wrestling a uh, real pro wrestler, and uh, I took a bump, and I'm pretty sure I broke my neck. <laughs> I'm almost what positive. Hit you, what did he hit you with? What move? No, oh, no, it was no. Just, it was he, just he did a bump of cocaine. <laughs> <laughs> Super hard. He would have been. Yeah. It was the good shit. Pure <laughs> Columbia, straight from Bogota. I probably wouldn't have felt it if I uh, <laughs> did the cocaine. Oh, I thought he like suplexed you or some shit. No, no, that Brandon was getting fucked up. <laughs> I mean, he's getting suplexed and all that type. All me, JJ, and Pat did. We just took a bump, and literally, my neck hurts right now. And that was on Saturday. Yeah, and it's Monday. And I'm a little concerned. Like, I, I woke up this morning, I'm like, should I go to the top thing? <laughs> I don't want to out of pride. I don't want to be like, I just fell on a mat and now I might need so to. So it go is to a mat, thing. though? You're actually in a ring? Yeah, no, it was a real ring. Okay. Everything was legit. Walkout thing and is all. Is it harder than it looks? Like, hell yeah. <laughs> Firmness. Dog, it's like a fucking wooden board on, oh, it, damn. on like it concrete. Like <laughs> it's hard. <laughs> it's fucking, yeah, it's hard. Did it got a little give to it. Did you stretch before you started no. doing it? Hell, I don't stretch, man. You gotta it's, stretch, it's not bro. good for you. <laughs> That's right. Randy Moss said never stretch. I don't think Randy Moss ever said that. Chad Ocho Cinco there. No, one, I, of the, one of the two? You, know, you, you can't you listen to Chad You know what's funny? Cinco. I know exactly who he's referring to. It's neither one of them. Who is it? It's Deion Sanders. There you go. But, well, even and, better. And even then. He, even better. He, was talk, he said, have you ever seen a lion stretch before they chase a gazelle? Yeah. They actually do. Yeah, <laughs> I'm about to say everything, everybody they stretches. Do yeah, they they always, stretch. always stretch. Cat shit. Cats always stretch. <laughs> That's hilarious. So you ever seen a lion? Bro, you're Deion Sanders. You're different. <laughs> Way different. You're a multi-sport professional athlete. Crazy. They're always doing this shit. Yeah, they look. <laughs> it's actually lion favorite stretching. <laughs> well, I guess he do. just typed in lion stretching. He's <laughs> like, I'll show you, Deion Sanders. <laughs> yeah, take that, idiot. <laughs> Coach of Colorado, don't know about feline stretches. <laughs> he, I know about big cat moves. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you have a big, big cat argument. I forgot about that. The cheetah thing. We did? Yeah, you know, we can fuck up cheetahs. We can fuck up. Well, Jesus. I believe that now. Yeah. But I didn't you know. do now. That's you do now. I guess so. I oh. guess they're pussies. Why? Well, because yeah, you see I mean, a lion stretching. No, that's not what made me think. Uh, I thought you saw the lion. <laughs> no, we like, saw the facts. Man, fuck that. That's what cats do. Cats are bitches. <laughs> <laughs> I think he's like six five. Who stood up? 
Oh, but, uh, probably over that. Yeah, yeah, so cheetahs don't kill anybody, bro. So no, nah, yeah, they, they can't. I guess they're easy to kill. They get they don't have retractable claws. Nope. Yeah. 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 Look at yeah. yeah. Now, now you spitting Learning. the facts that we know. <laughs> yeah. 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 They got little teeth too. Y'all know yeah. yeah. I know all about that. We can fuck them up. <laughs> they growl. Yeah. They can't even. Uh... No, they don't growl. No, they like. I'm sorry. They bark. They, yeah. No, the they don't roar. That's what you're thinking. Yeah. yeah. They don't roar, but they they go like. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> well, did that. you watch one cheetah documentary or something? What happened? No, you told me. And we I, looked it up. Oh. And then I've been telling other people, like, yeah, apparently cheetahs are bitches. <laughs> I've been telling everybody. Hell yeah. <laughs> oh, we got to sign in to Real Africa. <laughs> <laughs> they ain't playing around <laughs> That's no crazy. more. <laughs> it's like, we've started this fake shit. Real Africa. <laughs> Is that the cheetah? Mm-hmm. Oh. <laughs> now I'm not say- uh, see if one of the motherfuckers bites you that will hurt but you gotta be ready for it well, they're kind of adorable when they sound like that <laughs> oh yeah I can take those cubs out oh <laughs> you wanna hear about my week Sure. Yes. Is that why you, brought, Dom, it? Dom that why you brought it up? No, Dom knows. I was, no, because I've been week? wrestling with myself on whether or not I should <laughs> tell this. Okay. I'm very curious. <laughs> so, I uh, I went to Huntsville Film Fest. Mm. Shout out to Huntsville Film Fest. Uh, it's Shout a, out. It's a Huntsville Horror Film Festival. Uh, it was at Campus 805. Really oh, yeah. amazing. They showed a lot of uh, horror films from around the world. Well, it's Hauntsville, like haunting, and then, okay, Dom, you, well, you just keep on typing. Yeah, yeah. no, nah, he's telling his... me like I'm not reading what he's typing. <laughs> yeah. You remember Men in Black when they opened up his head and it was that alien in there? <laughs> <laughs> Dom's got one of them, but they, the alien's doing coke while he's typing. <laughs> it's just the same as Dom. Yeah, he's getting yeah. high on the job. <laughs> uh, but anywho. Haunts like haunting. Hey, just, just put an A yeah, in front of you. This okay, is not board. I'll put the picture. All on. right, I'm just saying you struggling. <laughs> <laughs> Anywho, I went to that. Then after that, I uh, I've decided I was like, oh, I'm a I'm a I'm a fuck. <laughs> I'm watching some scary movies. Papa wants to get his freak on, right? Okay. So uh, <laughs> I take about four edibles, right? It's uh, your fucking juice, yeah. Yeah. Okay. So it's ten milligrams per, so forty milligrams ain't shit. That's a good bit. That, no, I've taken more, but I'm saying it's, I know you've taken more, but you're about to try to have sex. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So uh, I while I'm taking the edibles, I go in my car and I see a little wrapper, and I was like, "What is this?" And it's a blue chew. It's a blue chew that one of our friends has given us, has given me. Sounds okay. like a good dude. <laughs> nice guy. That's a cool shit to get. He somebody. was almost an he accessory. He granted you a hard penis. Yeah. yeah. He's almost an accessory. Okay. <laughs> what did you do? <laughs> I ate the blue chew. <laughs> so I ate the blue chew. All right. And I go to the lady's house, and things are g- getting off to a good start. Where'd you meet the lady? Where'd that? She's an old. She's you an old know friend. Her? Yeah, I already know her. Okay, I thought you were macking on bitch. No, 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 no. I already knew her. But this was one of those things where I'm like, I'm gonna have a great time. Like I'm having a great time tonight, and I want to go do some porn star type shit. <laughs> so that's why I took the blue chew and the edibles. I'm gonna be high <laughs> out my mind, but my dick is gonna just be concrete rock hard and creative yeah i'm just out there dangerous man bro. yeah i'm gonna be doing all kinds yeah. of shit the moves that i can think of my nigga, the moves <laughs> that i had i was gonna hit it with the boogeyman that's why i come from up under the bed oh yeah that's tough yeah it was gonna be nuts uh <laughs> it was going to be okay. it was going to be a little foreshadowing a little bit so we start making out and then she goes on to tell me she goes on to tell me Something that just made my penis go soft. Even on the even on drugs? Even on the drugs. Well, it came out of nowhere. The the bit of news she gave me came out of nowhere. And it was like within our first two seconds of making out. Damn, it's early. So it was early, right. So now I'm like, oh shit. So I'm kind of listening to her processing that, mm-hmm. taking that all in. And I start to feel my heart racing a little bit. And I go, oh yeah. I took that blue chew. Well, shit. 
I probably still need to fuck because <laughs> I have this in my system now. I need to fuck. I need to fuck. So I'm trying to get out of the mindset of where I am uh-huh. and get back into the mode of fucking. So I kind of I can kind of feel myself getting out of it. I'm like, all right, let's do this. I can muster it up. I'm ready to fuck. Let's go ahead. So we start fucking and things are going great. But at the same time, at the more I'm fucking, I'm starting to feel like a little bit of pressure. And I'm starting to hear a ringing in my ears. That's really bad. I know. So I'm I'm getting a little afraid. So I start thinking. <laughs> I think my blood pressure is getting high because I'm just, I'm just, <laughs> you think? I'm really just doing medical knowledge that I've heard on TV. I'm like, all right, I know these pills make blood go to your penis. I have a heart. My heart pumps blood, blood pressure. <laughs> blood, penis, heart. Yeah, blood, penis, heart. <laughs> Dr. sci I might have a stroke. <laughs> but I was like, I got to keep, I got to keep fucking to make sure I don't have this stroke. <laughs> so don't stop moving. Yeah. So I did an amazing job. I did an amazing job. She comes, big ass sex? orgasm. Yeah, she's cool. I don't come though. I don't come. <laughs> and in Sick. fact, while she's coming, I, I start doing a lap around the room because now my head's feeling a little funny. <laughs> yeah, what the fuck? <laughs> naked? Yeah, but naked. naked. <laughs> With dick rock hard. Kind of still on and everything, Get the baby. Baton on you. She's yeah. just over there coming, and it looks like I'm summoning a demon dog. Because yeah. you gotta imagine, it's it's pitch black in the room, and I'm just naked, just going. <laughs> it's in my head. Yeah, she probably thinking I'm just enjoying the best slice of pussy I've ever had. She's like, damn, have you ever made a dude do a lap? <laughs> so she like, yo, you cool? And I go, no, I got to go to your bathroom. So now I'm freaking out because I can feel my heart like racing in my chest. Yeah, I hate that feeling. <laughs> and so I go, yo, I got to make myself throw up because that's the only way I'm going to get this shit out of my system. <laughs> And just the thought about it, just the thought of it, I threw up all over her bathroom. I started throwing up violently. I, we get it into the toilet or whatever. I'm still throwing up. She's, uh, <laughs> what? <laughs> I start not only throwing up, but now <laughs> because of my heart's going, I forgot I took in the edibles too, but those started kicking in. Yeah. So now I think I'm dying, right? <laughs> and I'm sweating profusely in her bathroom. This is how she, you're going to go? And right? this is how I'm going to go. That's the only thought oh, I kept having. Damn. This is how I'm going to die. I hate that. So I'm like over her toilet and I just keep talking to myself and I'm like, damn, is this, this is it. This is where it fucking ends. This is how the story of me fucking ends. So I go, not like this. So I told her, I was like, hey, grab your phone. <laughs> she goes, what's up? I was like, I want, I don't want things that I have to, like, I want to say to people go unsaid. So she starts writing down my last words and shit. What the fuck? <laughs> I swear to God, no. I swear to what God. The I swear fuck? to God. What's funny is I only got to I only got to four people. Who would you get to? <laughs> Sent. Okay. His twin brother. Gotcha. His older brother. Okay, you love his family. And my mom. <laughs> and your mom. And my All mom. Right. <laughs> I told Sent and his brother, his twin brother, I was like, I love y'all. Y'all are the best friends I could have. Oh Ask my for. God. All this other shit. Love you. But his older brother, I was like, yo, get your shit together, my guy. You fucking up right now. <laughs> yo. <laughs> you, you being toxic. <laughs> At one point, in, I, I'll show you the message she sent it to me after this. I, I, I said, because you said I love this family, I said, your family deserves so much better than this. Oh, my shit. God. I said something weird as hell. Yeah, and then I told <laughs> my mom I loved her. And then I, I started blacking out. But I legitimately felt like I was about to die. You're and describing a possession. Like it was the first time in my life where I was like, "Oh, this is it. This is this is it." You know, when the ears start ringing, that's when you get scary, bro. I've I've never been more terrified in my life, and that's how we're gonna start off this November. It's Men's M- Mental Health Month, everybody. Yeah, <laughs> text your friends horrible things. About them. <laughs> Don't do <laughs> tell them the truth and blue chews. I'm never doing one of those motherfuckers again. I'll, I'll tell you that. I'm never doing nothing like. I say that now. Wait till like two, Bryce. three years. Yeah, it's good shit. Yeah, I think it's an edible. Hmm? I think mixing. With <laughs> yeah, I think yeah, that makes your heart race. Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah, yeah I was wild. Yeah, uh, 
That is a full possession you had. What's a full possession? A possession of what? Ha- you went to a haunted place. You came oh, back. Oh, shit. You made a girl come, <laughs> as ghosts do. Right? Have you seen the movies? <laughs> I've seen some movies. And then you ran around the room, sprinted over and threw up. <laughs> uh-huh. Ghost shit. That is ghost shit. And then, yeah, you thought you were dying and you told somebody to write down your last memoirs. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah. So you can haunt the place later. Dude. That's how ghosts get in. Yeah, maybe. Maybe I am a ghost. Oh, hell no. What the fuck is this you pulled up? No, it's just possession. I'm just giving examples of possession. Yeah. What you oh. Dude, that's crazy though. Yeah, that's 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 what I was. <laughs> that's how I was looking at the toilet right there. <laughs> My eyes were rolling back and everything, bro. <laughs> right after you make a girl come though, at least you got the job. Yeah, at least I got the you job. You got the job bro. done. But man, that was. That's crazy. Yeah, yeah. And you know what I kept thinking too? I just <laughs> she doesn't know. All, all she she knows. No, no, no. <laughs> she made her no, type, type no, no, no. Shit. She knows. No, no, no. no. <laughs> Her, she thinks that I had the whole panic attack and everything from what she told me. Well, she, that was That's horrible. good. You you put your remember when I was like else. remember when I was like Making right before up. we had sex mm-hmm. she said something. She thinks I reacted that way to what she said. The whole time I kept blacking out. There was one point where I was like, I might need an ambulance. I was like, I ain't gonna tell this girl I took a dick pill. I might just die here. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck that. I was like, yeah, man. I, I think it was my win, bro. She gonna tell her. Yeah. She gonna tell my mom. <laughs> She's gonna tell my mom. <laughs> they be like, what happened? He took a dick pill. Got God. a fucking dick pill. What a fucking moron. being mean to his friends. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Through somebody else. Vicariously mean. Be vicariously yeah. mean. <laughs> we should do that. We should open up a business where you can be vicariously mean through people. So you you like anonymously mean, you mean? No. Kinda? Not uh-huh. even anonymous. Like so we get a whole bunch of autistic people, right? Oh, and that's who we the hire. Best at it. Yeah. Yeah. And so you can hire let's say Jake. You hire Jake <laughs> and he, Jake will go up and just tell like your coworker, like, hey, your breath smells like shit. And, you, and they're like, Who sent you? And you'd be like, Don't like, worry about tell that. You. Yeah, don't worry about that. <laughs> you stink. Just know somebody Everybody thinks so. hired me to let you know. You I, smell like hippopotamus nutsack. What's crazy is there's actually a guy out there that does this, and I have the clip pulled up for them. Nuh-uh. Swear to God. That wasn't even planned, ladies and gentlemen. No, it wasn't at all. That's nuts. I still don't believe it. Damn, he's black, too. And autistic? No, I don't think That's this nigga weird. autistic. He looks like What is your shit. company doing now? Was it formed? <laughs> it is. <laughs> OCDA is an acronym for Occupation and Cares Diversity Affairs. Uh, and what we do is people go to my website, they file a complaint about their boss or their supervisor, anything like that. We show it to the job and we cuss their ass out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, all, all, everything you want to say to your boss, everything you want to say to your boss that you can't say, y'all contact us, go to our website, ocdaofficial.com. And we'll show up and say all the things you want us to say, verbatim. Is it anonymous? Like, do they know who it's? Oh yeah, the complaints are totally anonymous, but I say everything verbatim, so you can curse on your complaints. I'm the curse anyway. Just hearing them talk. What you mean it ain't verbatim? I bet he he misses a couple words. No, I guarantee (laughs) he hitting every single motherfucker because he didn't even say anonymous. (laughs) He missed that word. Oh well, if you hiring this motherfucker to curse out your boss, you're not asking him to. Like, hit you with a Scrabble true, word. True, you right, know what I'm saying? Right. No, I believe this guy. Is, this is a good business. Oh, yeah. I love this business. Yeah, this is dope. We should hire him to come curse out Dom. <laughs> That'd be great, bro. Is he local? Yeah, right. Dude, OCDA, I think is what it was. OCDA. We got, hey, we got him. We'll, do. <laughs> we'll get your monkey ass. I can't <laughs> wait for that. Here goes an example. We'll teach you for talking oh, spicy. Examples? <laughs> Oh, hell yeah. Hey, how you doing? How you doing? All right. Can I have you? My name is Agent Ratliff with Ocean Cares Diversity Affairs, ID number 33712. And I was coming here looking for see a lead, Mr. Lee right here. Okay. I'm coming out here to go over some complaints. Do well, you have an uh, office? you want to go over these complaints? No, I'm not the one to talk to. I don't have any idea what this is about. Your name on this list. It say right <laughs> here, uh, y'all, to humble yourself. Cause y'all don't know shit. Y'all be talking about people behind their back. 
Anson and the receptionist is fucking and getting high at work. They say y'all racist <laughs> as fuck. Y'all ain't shit and everybody wish Nick was still here. Now who is Nick? <laughs> <laughs> That were filed on behalf of the company. Hell yeah. Now, who is 22, 2217 Rock Chapel Road. That's us. Give me more information about you. And what is she doing? This is recorded. You First of all, you need to calm your attitude now, man. <laughs> yeah, I don't like the attitude. Ain't Come no out way. here loud. Like and when I came in, yeah. nobody okay. nobody greeted me. That is the door. <laughs> <laughs> nah, you get your ass up out of here. All y'all. Y'all is racist because nobody greeted me when I came <laughs> in this motherfucker. For a, a, for a company. I am the cop. I don't give a fuck about y'all calling no cops. Get your black ass out of here. Yeah, she got tired. Racist. Get him. You heard what he said? Get him. He said, get your black ass out of here. What are we talking about here? We got it on camera. He just said, get your black ass out of here. To another, you don't stick hey, to negative. You can talk to him. You can talk to me. What okay, you what's your name, sir? My name is John. John. My name is Agent Ratliff with Ocean Cares Diversity Fair. <laughs> 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 uh, 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 bro, what the fuck? Lady right I love here. this guy, fam. Yeah, that's get the fuck out. Get the fuck out. Get the fuck out. Get the fuck out. He ain't fired. You don't act like that while you're on the fucking clock. It don't matter. I'll shut all this shit now. He just said, get your black ass out here and it's on camera. And we, that's a fucking lawsuit. He did not say that. Yes, he did. We got it on camera, motherfucker. <laughs> he sure did, bro. He got it. He you got, got him got slipping, it. bro. You know what I that's love? That's the most amazing thing I've ever seen. It, that's funny I as shit. I love this guy. But did you notice how when he was like, we got it. He, we got him on camera, and you, they looked. The old dude had his phone like. Yeah. <laughs> I, I love when people are getting pissed off, and they, they see they're getting filmed. So they're like, I'm going to film you. Dude, that's the yeah. best. He holding it down. A film on. To off. be honest, bro. You like when that you get, shit? When you get filmed? Well, I just don't know any other better option. Uh, I guess. Yeah, that's it? all what, you can When do. you're getting filmed, bro, yeah. it, everything gets in, enhanced by a thousand. Mm. When you're getting filmed, because you can't. That's true. Like, am I also, do I also look fat, too? Oh, <laughs> <it's>, <laughs> All these thoughts go in your head. It's like, I'm getting roasted, and I'm other kind of fat today. I will say this. Anytime, like, especially in high school, if I got into a fight, uh. I did make sure nobody had a phone out. <laughs> Because it did feel like the pressure yeah, would be yeah. on like a thousand. Oh yeah, for sure. It's, it's like now nah, if I get my ass beat, I have to go like ultra instinct if <laughs> I, I see a phone. This guy's I, head I, in. Yeah. I can't. I you can't film me getting <laughs> fucked up. I'm my, sorry. My boy on camera right now, and look, it came all the way to me. He live in Illinois, and him getting knocked out by some con- country ass uh, short fat. Like, really fat white dude. Damn. And he hit him and he said, he said, what now, boy? <laughs> oh! Kicked him in the ribs, dog. God! Kicked Dang. The, kicked him in the ribs. And then it was two two people he came there with. Didn't even do that. <laughs> Shit. Was this fat guy like a good fighter? No, oh, he's he never. He, he said he never fought before in his life. The fat well, dude? That, that was a story that I heard. <laughs> was that in the post fight interview? <laughs> no, <laughs> this dude whooped your friend's ass, and then they gave him a post fight yeah. interview. After. How long you been training for? It's actually my, <laughs> it's actually my <laughs> first fight. First fight my, <laughs> I'm in know. the best shape I've ever yeah. been in. <laughs> Want to know who's next, boy? <laughs> yeah. And new <laughs> champion of racism. <laughs> dude, that's, that's nuts. That's horrible. Yeah. That's nuts. He deserves. That's why he can't be out. <laughs> he, he said he deserves. He would hundred percent. Deserve. Probably talking shit. Oh, it's one hundred percent his fault. <laughs> no, he wanted them. He Nobody wanted fights them. their first time in their mid forties. Oh, it's oh your friend's that's first true. Time. No, 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 my, no, my friend fights. <laughs> the friend, he's thirty six. Uh, the guy who got his, the guy who whooped his ass. It's a man in his mid forties, and he's saying, "You know how much of an asshole you got to be for a dude who ain't never fought." True. If over forty years ago. Yeah. You know what? God damn it, that's enough. It's time. Here it is. It's time that's it's true. Time. You got your friend's a dick. Hey, oh no, that's he, crazy. No, he's a piece of shit. But uh, <laughs> <laughs> look, afterwards, I came home. Right, I came home back to visit, and I seen him. And he don't know I know, even though the video is all out on the internet. Yeah. And so I'm, I'm like, well, I'm like, what you do last weekend? <laughs> he's oh, like, uh, he's like, oh, I went to OKC. I'm like, what fuck, you go to OKC for? He's, like, I just had to get away. And then <laughs> he still don't know I know. But then three hours later, he was like. Yeah, you, you hear about me getting whooped. <laughs> That's all you can think That's about, That's all you can think about, That's, about. That's the worst. That's all he was thinking about. <laughs> That's Hell yeah. so bad. Oh, he low-key wanted you to go, no, what? He did. Ah, it was nothing. Yeah, I was like, yeah, I seen it. Damn. <laughs> I oh, saw that's it, dog. That's why I called you. I got it in my phone right now. Can you, can you imagine getting your ass fucking whooped, right? It happened like an hour ago. The events are over. You on your couch. 
lights are out. You're just like, yo, I just <laughs> want tonight so to be over. <laughs> yeah. And then your phone just start going off. Because oh, <laughs> you know, once people see you and they like, hold on. Is that Bryce? <laughs> hey, nigga, this you getting knocked out. That's all anybody. That's how mm-hmm. everybody's greeting you. Hey, man, I saw you getting fucked up on my phone. Which is crazy. It's nuts. That'd be insane. Because not <laughs> nobody can fight for real. And it makes you want to fight again. <clears throat> yeah, now you gotta go find now, him. And now you want to fight him, but at the same time, you don't want that shit. Kind of similar to him. Yeah, and whoop his ass. <laughs> you gotta make sure you can whoop that second <laughs> like, dude's ass. Excuse me, can you hold my phone? I'm about to get in a fight. I gotta win this one. <laughs> I think there's certain instances where you have to win a fight. If the phone, is, if the phone gets pulled out, you gotta win. If you're fighting in front of your children, yeah, yeah, that's. Bad. If you're fighting the dude you just walked in fucking your wife. Oh god. <laughs> just the three you, you got to kill him. You got to you got to like, win all three of those. Yeah, you can't As lose. a man, mm. you can't win those those three, bro. I've seen it. Dude's losing that fight too. Yeah. Which one? Of the cheating wife walking oh, and then get floored. Bro, if cuz he's all he's busy at work. This other dude just works out and fucks wives all day. I know. <laughs> so he's <laughs> Hold not on. ready for Put this. some respect on Jody's name. <laughs> yeah, Jody, what you know about Jody? Oh boy. Marvin Cease, man. See, Marvin no, C's. I, I have no idea. Well, he's saying it because of the military. Yeah, that's when they say we, we used to have a uh, a cadence call. Jody got your wife. Yeah. Whenever, really? like, whenever <laughs> every fuck you got, you come home from down rain, mm-hmm. and then you you be black, and then you find out your boy uh, wife done left him and took all his shit, and then he be, <laughs> sergeant would be like, Jody got you, huh? Who's Jody? Jo- Jody's that. Jody's a made up person. Made up person okay. that always fucks your wife. Yeah. So no matter what you're doing, Jody's <laughs> at home fucking your wife. Yeah. Now. Not in the military, but there used to be this blues singer named Marvin Cease. I forget, his name is last name is S E A S E, so however you pronounce that. Okay. His whole thing was he's Mister Jody, oh. and his whole persona was he was like, I ain't doing shit. While you at work, I'm fucking your wife, <laughs> driving your car, and he was making hit blues records. Just Damn. talk. He got this one song where this, the sad. husband calls his phone. He's like. Yo, can I talk to my wife? <laughs> and he goes, "Who should I say is calling?" <laughs> oh no! I'm, when we get off, I'm gonna put you on some Marvin Cease, bro. His shit is nuts. That is some super gangster. Mm-hmm. How old is it? Oh, dude, Marvin dead. Uh, he was. This some shit, yo. Like this that some shit. Been your been... mama probably was would have wow. listened to. You know what I'm saying? If she was old enough. I'm saying they might have got it from uh, him. The military might have got it from him. He, I mean. If it's old enough, I mean, sure. I th- he he might have got it from the military. I don't know, but Mr. Jody, I'm your Mr. Jody. He got a song called Candy Liquor. It's the funniest shit. It's all about eating pussy. It's an old <laughs> nigga song. He's like, he's like, I, baby, I can lick you up and down, round and round. I can be your candy liquor, <laughs> and then it goes, uh, uh, uh. Uh, uh, uh. Like he's sticking his tongue out. It's the funniest shit in the world, bro. I love Marvin Cease. What's this? Is is this uh We're on a true art. We are this on art? a uh, mode of uh, fighting. So this happened at a um, Florida. I thought Gators, they were hugging. Gators match. Match. Oh, oh shit! He's getting it in, bro. Oh, okay, hold on. The, oh, the white cop oh. is fucking up the nigga, and the black cop is fucking up him. I love it. That's that's. That's how we cure racism. I'm okay with that. That's crazy. Oh, no, man. That's a white Oh, that's dude. a white dude? Yeah, damn, yeah. my fault. God damn, damn Hammer bro. fist, bro. Hammer fist. That white guy is sturdy as fuck, though. I oh, yeah. dropped after the first one. He oh, can't look, punch me in the back of the head like that. He's got a cul-de-sac hairline, too, so he's like 50 plus. 60s. Easily. He should have went down after a couple. God Look, he, damn. He's just grabbing dick and taint right there. He's just trying to grab something. There's a dude in the back recording in that gray shirt. Oh, you can't see him right now. He's like Somebody biting. is he's right like, behind him. Yeah, go back. Everybody is, man. He's like biting his lip and watching, bro. <laughs> he's just biting kind of this dude right here? No, it was a dude earlier. He's a younger guy. Way earlier. Damn, she got her foot on that dude? Did my, oh, there he is. Yeah. He's like biting his lip. Hold on, Let's do it right here. <laughs> yeah, give it a second. This is exciting shit. This is very exciting. It has to be. Is that are they all fucking Florida fans? 
Florida versus Georgia. Georgia, looks Georgia like. yeah. Oh, so that's a rivalry game. I see too. some red over there, too. Yeah, oh, look, he yeah, started biting yeah. his lip. He started biting it. Yeah, he's like, damn, boy. Damn, look at Old Man River. That's the original <laughs> Negro from Georgia. <laughs> that's, right the, that's the first black guy, bro. That's crazy. <laughs> that's the first one. Hell no. <laughs> that nigga used to babysit Frederick Douglass. <laughs> <laughs> now you can see a black dude whoop a white guy. Oh, now. my God. Yeah, you know yo, he's loving that in shit. Georgia? <laughs> yeah. Dude, this dude is like. This is he, the best day of my life. <laughs> they go like, tell us about the game. He's like, man, this boy was fucking them crackers up. <laughs> about 10 to 12 times on the top of his head. Every, look, that's why he's smiling. If you he's look, laughing, he's bro. looking he down, he's just like, what a day. This what is, a day. <laughs> <laughs> that man is having the best time of his life. I fucking love that, man. <laughs> That's crazy. Hell yeah. He was killing that guy. He was. He straight up murdering that man. That's crazy. He was. Hell no. <laughs> what, what this, this is a video with the caption of uh, never sleep with your windows down in your car. Mm-mm. Don't ever do that. You ever fallen asleep in your car? It is very relaxing. I, just, I literally can't. I've tried so many times. Really? Yeah, like, can you um, sleep like in a, a car? Long Hell long yeah. Day. I know you can. <laughs> I can sleep anywhere. I'm surprised. Oh, man, I've seen you pass out in your recliner too many times. You yeah. But I uh, I used to not be able to, for real, for real. And then uh, I had to borrow Sense uh, Buick. Mm. And he's got this mode where it just, like, and it's a Buick. If you've never gotten into a Buick... Go if you have a grandparent who's got a Buick, a Lincoln, a Cadillac, sleep in it. Go, just, no, just, <laughs> just go sit in their shit, and you're gonna start going, oh, because it's nothing but a a big ass couch, pretty much. Oh yeah, it's all the seats are super they're comfy cushioned. as fuck, and they're deep. Exactly. They're deep I press fuck. the button. That shit not only laid mm-hmm. me back, it pushed, it pulls the uh, steering wheel away from me, mm-hmm. and pretty much made a perfect bed in there. I rolled down the windows and had my feet out the window, letting the breeze go through my toes. Ooh. I fell asleep out there at 3 o'clock in the morning. I was scared as shit. You woke up at 3 or you fell asleep at 3? I fell asleep at like 11. I woke oh, up at 3. Damn. But either way, I fell asleep in a car with the window down with my toes hanging out. With your toes hanging out? Yeah. What were you so chill for, bro? It was 11 p.m. Yeah. <laughs> were you so relaxed at 11? I, was, I, I didn't expect to go to sleep. Get your senses up, bro. Uh, That's crazy. I got caught slipping. Yeah, I, 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 I would have came you. and tickled your ass. So yeah, quick, bro. Come on, come on, come on. <laughs> you gonna tickle my ass? Uh, yes. Because <laughs> like, I thought about it. I'm in. I'm already in this. Sure, I'll take your butt. That's fine. I'm, I'm not the weird that. one here, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I don't care. I call the cops. He's like, I'm weird. I'm weird. This motherfucker fell asleep with the window down, his toes out. His feet. You know how hard it is to get someone's pants yeah. off and tickle their ass with their <laughs> feet off. <laughs> he made it easy. <laughs> He's the weirdo. Roll it up. Anyway, I'm just saying I probably understand this guy's pain. Okay. Bryce, you won't have to worry about this. Sci-fi, maybe. Because I don't have a job? Because <laughs> <laughs> you don't I sleep in the car. Oh! How'd you do that? <laughs> Damn! <laughs> What'd he say? He said the fuck. He just had it. <laughs> 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 Quick reaction time. <laughs> the fact that this dude got in his car, so did he drive around and park, hop out to do that, and then peel off? He must have passed him one time. This is downtown. That's he must have passed him. Was like, that's a sleeping ass. That guy's sleeping his window open. Motherfucker. And I just got eggs. Mm, yeah, I'm just going to waste the egg. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Can you... Gotta find a if he knows him, that's just a really funny prank. If he no doesn't know him, he knows him, bro. <laughs> it's so psychotic. He's like, I gotta find eleven more sleeping dudes <laughs> yeah. to finish his egg, <laughs> to finish his carton. <laughs> that's crazy. That spot. is, I love it. That's though. just that kind of shit that is just like life's kind of life life's, sucks. Life's a cartoon. Li- yeah, sometimes, sometimes. This guy by fucking. Got a cartoon pistol. Bro. Yeah, for what real. He's got a Y I on it. I don't trust this man at all. Oh, y'all never seen this? Yeah, yo, no. Yosemite Sam head ass. Great. This is uh, just an instructor at a gun range. Oh, this is going to be crazy. I love gun He's ranges. He's about to shoot this guy's head off. <laughs> right. You want to you hold it like this? <laughs> right. Now, you want to put the pew pew in it down ain't... that way. Oh, boy.
Oh. <laughs> you lying you know bitch. Yo, what the fuck happened? Yeah, yeah put it down. Put it down. He Yo. still kept he still kept instructing afterwards. That's so funny. <laughs> I've never lost all confidence in someone doing their job so fast. So he just shot it right there? He shot like up it. into the angle? Bro? Like so, it it so, so he was trying to show him, but he cocked it back yeah. and it accidentally hit the trigger. And it's a magnum, so it's so powerful. It, it yeah. literally almost blew his fucking... Right here, that gun just uh, recoiled back and almost blew his fucking shit. Clean the mm -hmm. fuck off. Mm -hmm. Oh, so that is a 357 mag? Yeah. That's that dirty hair. Look, look right Ooh. here. Look, you see that? Woo! Definitely just That's chip what, the tooth. It hasn't went off yet. Bam. I mean, he's so he close shot to right his face. beside his face. Yeah. Yo. Damn. It, those things are so hard to control unless you're holding it right. Did you mean to do that? Damn. Yeah, man. I meant to he shoot did. the person was, above yeah. me, bro. Yeah, I really wanted you, to fuck he, up. There's no way he didn't get fired. Because you know, they, God. they got to go back and watch that tape and just go, yeah, there's bro. a fucking hole in the ceiling. When you slow it down, he's missing a lot of teeth already. Yeah. I'm starting to think. <laughs> yeah, he's missing some teeth in there, bro. <laughs> yeah, I think this is not the first time. <laughs> that is just scary seeing that. Ah. Ba bang. <laughs> <laughs> Boink. <laughs> I like the jumps after it played a little faster. Hey, he got back right though. He's like, All right, hey, he got back right hey. fast. Hey, that's training. That's training. <laughs> yeah. That's where the training kicks in. <laughs> Hell no. The police officer's got to figure it out, bro. The closer I get to you, sexy bitches and food. Uh huh. Saw Dom looks at it murder on Dom's <laughs> Twitter feed. <laughs> I'm waiting to see some butt cheeks. Spread those cheeks Spread and those show cheeks. me the hole. Hey. Mike hey. Tyson. I'm trying to see your dirty soul. <laughs> Ooh. Yeah, I'm looking at souls okay. through holes. Yeah, you're, you're possessed for sure. <laughs> I'm possessed. You're trying to see souls <laughs> through your butt cheeks. If I, you know what's crazy? If I was possessed, I would want to be... Uh, oh, I've been watching a couple of uh, animes. What you been watching? Uh, I, this is good. I, I hopped it back into uh, Uzumaki. Uzumaki. Scary. Which made me get in Inuyasha. Inuyasha? Hell yeah. yeah. And hell yeah. Uh, somebody showed me another one, but uh, Japanese demons look cool as hell, boy. Hell yeah. They, they are like one horn and long yeah, hair. Just crazy. They're kind of depressed. It's super depressed. Or they'll be like just, a, it's like a naked woman just crying. Yeah. And then her tears are like. Spider web. She's like, what the fuck is this? <laughs> Just some shit that over there. They're like, it's the American way of thinking that I've learned. They just, I'm saying, we all kind of have like a familiarity to it. So when we think of demons, we think of demons one way. But yeah. you got to imagine if you live in Japan your whole life, you're going to think of demons a whole different way. True. I, all, that's what I was trying to get to we're say. We're all different, but the same. Yeah. You hear that, people? Mm -hmm. Except for Dom. He's different and different. Okay. Yeah, different Dom, throughout. Throughout, different's cool though. Yeah, yeah, it's cool. It does sound pretty cool. Dom is different. I don't, I don't Scientists want to <laughs> experiment on him, <laughs> dissect him. What is he? <laughs> why is why is his blood as thick as fudge? <laughs> <laughs> What's up with why does his toe smell hey, like hey, that? Fudge blood. <laughs> fudge blood. <laughs> That's a good one. Hey, fudge blood. Oh, sounds a little racist. You know how last episode we gave our um. We gave our uh, scary movies. Scary movies. Mm -hmm. Yeah, another good one to watch. The Witch. Mm -hmm. It's I, too late. It, no, it's never too late. If you watch the we last wait, episode, you got through all. It's kind of too late, man. You can't can, be watching scary movies in Thanksgiving time. Yeah, you dude, crazy. It's, it, I will. The time is you had all of October. Yeah. So you can only watch scary movies in October. <laughs> Most people do. Yeah. Okay, then what movies do you watch in November? Thanksgiving related. Yeah, movies. family <laughs> movies. <laughs> That's a Thanksgiving related movie. It's probably it's probably also scary if it's like a Big Mama's House. That's not a Thanksgiving movie. Sunday dinner still the same thing. Sunday dinner, yeah, yeah, I don't you, believe. That's more Easter. Eat. People got to What I say, Big Mama's House. You I'm talking Big about Mama's soul house. food. Okay, soul food. Now that that could be a Thanksgiving dinner movie. Uh, Bryce, you know about this this movie? You know I don't. You don't know about soul food. You Big know, I have no idea. It ain't Big nothing Ma my herbs can't hit. Her. <laughs> Big Mama lost a toe, boy. It took off her whole goddamn leg. <laughs> Soul food is the saddest shit because it's a real story about every black household. <laughs> it's all about this black woman whose family came from Mississippi and she brought back up, you know, them real shit ways of cooking. So mm -hmm. she'd just be double frying. Throwing some stank on it. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. Huh? Hey, black guys. Huh? Stank? Ah! 
That's what I thought you would say. <laughs> you know, she's putting some things oh, you, up in the kitchen. You. <laughs> fuck you. He said, throw some stank on it. Stank on that thing. <laughs> <laughs> Hell no. But the whole family is just toxic, and then they eat a whole bunch of salty, greasy food, and that's what helps. That's what the down. movie's about? Yeah. No, well, the movie's about soul food. It's, it's made from the heart. Now, she <laughs> does get diabetes in the end and dies, but <laughs> it's still. They cut her foot off. But it was fun. Yeah. All that chicken. It was great food. Well, it's not. You went to chicken. Yeah, well, you did go straight you to did, chicken. You did that go was straight wild. to chicken. What else is there? Edu- oh, oh, my, my God. God. What else is it? <laughs> Chicken, and then the greens, and then you got what else? Cornbread. Yep, that's, that's gonna be on there. Bread. Mix it with the greens, baby. Go ahead. Continue. Chicken, cornbread, greens. Is Brussels sprouts also green? No, nah, that, that no? shit ain't in there. No, Not I ain't sprouts. never been to a black house and they cooked up some Brussels sprouts. Look it up. Not soul food. <laughs> not, not soul not, food. Not on soul not food. They ain't putting up no, mac and cheese. Up. Yes. Yeah, but what kind? Black people mac and cheese. <laughs> The black people kind, yes. <laughs> black people mac and cheese. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. Yo, he is foolish. You don't even get it. You know, if you would have watched Malcolm X, you would have had more. Yeah, you you could have done part. <laughs> um, not pork. <laughs> well, no. it depends on whose house. It depends on whose shit. house. Really? Yeah, I'm going up to Detroit for uh, Thanksgiving, and because I'm coming. They already know, cause some of my family still eat chitlins. Oh, that's they're like, yo, shit. he coming? Chitlins. No pork on this, no pork on mm-hmm. that. That's cool. That we do that at ours too, for my yeah. cousin. He you don't, got he to don't eat. He don't eat. I know a lot of black people don't eat pork. Yeah, that's the thing. No matter what, it's always one of us who hey. don't eat pork. Hey, yeah, look at me. It's them kind. Oh yeah, it's the Muslim. That's kind. what I was thinking. No, nah, the real chocolate kind. <laughs> Ooh, <laughs> not. Whatever tan man over there is <laughs> pretending to be. <laughs> you cosplay as black people. <laughs> you know what would be dope? We got to get Dom, like, we just got to send him places. Like, yo, here's <laughs> here's Dom at, like, the Puerto Rican Day Parade. Just, oh, yeah. And yeah, he yeah, just yeah. blends in with people. Like, send Dom to, like, an Indian market. <laughs> and really and he's like, what do I do? Just stay there. Dude, Trust you, me. You'll feel it. Yeah. yeah oh yeah. They try to marry me to their daughters until Ooh. they until they find out I'm uh American. Until they hear me talk. You know? Yeah. Wait, wait a second. Yeah. Yeah. I told you about the time I was in Home Depot Mm-mm. and uh it was this uh older Indian woman. I'm I'm going through the uh the aisles and she look at me, she smile, and then she comes back. And she comes back too fast, she comes up to me, and she's like Hey, how you doing? Where are you from? And I'm like, uh, Illinois. And she was like, I swear to God, she goes, where are you really from? And I'm like, Illinois. And she was like, oh, I thought you were Indian. And get, blank, then that smile went to a blank face and she walked the fuck off. Damn. Damn. Yeah. You should have went with it. Hmm? You should have said something. I mean, if you hear me talk, I mean, yeah, I've never heard one Indian talk like me. Or yeah. anything close. But they could be like super like... Parents moved here two generations ago or something. You hear Asaj Minaj, whatever his name is? Yeah. <laughs> you still, he, he, but they, they, they go white whenever they talk. What is it? Asaj Minaj? Asaj Minaj. <laughs> <laughs> Minizzi. Hey, yo. This that could, that could be, be your fucking Indian name, yeah. bro. Yo, Massage is not. Yeah, no Asaj Minaj. <laughs> Massage Minaj. Massage Minaj is your Indian name. That's so funny. That is nuts. That we you need just... to come up with a different name for each race. Yeah, each race. Yeah. That he is. A silly play on words. <laughs> Dude, that's funny. So Massage bro, Minaj. He just sure. came up with it. I find if somebody who looks as Indian as you do at times, <laughs> I would think you would do some research on the culture. Fuck no. Just... <laughs> It's funnier if you don't know anything. Yeah, I don't want to know fact, anything. But that's the thing is the fact that you're completely ignorant to it. Like, it's great. I would just I think it. over time he'll be like, I got one. Something people keep just so, <laughs> just <laughs> because it keeps happening. He's like, no, why would I? Man. <laughs> you're the embodiment of America. Damn right. Damn right I am. Good and bad. You are yeah. everything. You're melting pot. Because this yeah. is a fucking America. And by the time this came out, good old Donald Trump will be president. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that nigga did not vote was, for all of y'all who who are Trump supporters who are like, yeah, tell him, Dom, that nigga can't read and he don't vote. So you just you pretty much just said, yeah, 
to a, he's almost a felon. He's this far away from being a felon. <laughs> he's trying to get a citizenship. Yeah. Charged, he, uh, not uh convicted. Right. That's now he's black. <laughs> <laughs> now I know for sure. <laughs> now I get Yo, it. what is going on? Oh, <laughs> Y'all <shit>. are nuts. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh. Cousin Faith. All right. Oh, she was a hoe. She was a hoe, but she fun. Oh, so speaking of fine women. Okay. Can you go to that third one that with the with the white bar at the bottom? Yeah, that one. Okay. All of these women are fine. Mm-hmm. All of them are fine. But Nia Long. Talk to him. The right? No, God. Far left. Far left. You don't know who Nia Long is? No. So Nia Long is that woman on the far left. She has been fine since the early 90s. Mm-hmm. She's still fine today, you think? Yeah. Oh, can you type in Nia Long? It's been 30 years. I know. It's Nia Long. Don't. Yeah, bro. That's yeah. Right now. You're right. Uh-huh. She used to, uh, she's the, uh. Look at that. You remember Ooh, email? I, I know she was fine. I know she got titties Ooh. like that now. God, okay. Hey, Udoka. I'm just saying her fine face, nigga. You ain't got to go in that big ass titties and shit. Well, she, I'm, I'm trying to look up the Friday. I'm trying to see some boobs. Look, this, this is, this is Nia Long from the night. Oh, look at you. Yeah, she's been fine literally. She's better now. Life. Yeah. That's crazy. Well, hold yeah. On. Hold on. You got to get it. She probably got fake boobs. Just hit 90s. I'm looking for one. <laughs> <Check> <laughs> it's Friday. Ooh. That's Nia Long. Mm. Nia Long. There's a one of the funniest videos ever. It's this they I don't I think they're at like a premiere or something. Have you seen a dumb? Where they're at a premiere or something, and Nia Long walks in. And this dude who's filming just goes, oh, God bless you. And she hears him and she goes, oh, well, thank you. And he's like, ha, ha. And as she walks away, he goes, I swear to God, boy. And everybody's like, hey, dog, you got to chill. <laughs> what do I do to her? Ooh. Uh, that's when you know you're getting old. We start that's, talking like that. That's yeah. that's when that old. I hear that shit all the time. Yeah. I, I used to think it was a joke, but old niggas love to. Talk about having oh, how they would boy. do it if they could. Yeah. Boy, if I could do Back it, I in my would day, I used to tear it up, boy. <laughs> <laughs> I had one just like them. Like, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like, what you talking that's about? That's it right there. <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy. Back in the day. Back in the day. Get so much pussy. <laughs> in my day, I was getting pussy left and right. Back in my day, boy, they used to call me Sweet Dick Sci-Fi. <laughs> <laughs> it's a sci-fi way to call you Sweet Dick Sci-Fi because I got a sweet old dick. Yeah, like it was super sweet. It was giving them cavities. <laughs> <laughs> Their teeth was right now. That's why I tell them, don't use your teeth, baby. No, they call me the candy man. Call me candy man. You heard the candy liquor? Come get that candy uh, cane. Lick it up and down. Uh, 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 uh. Marvin Cease. Marvin Cease. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, y'all go... Go home, listen to Marvin Cease, whether it be Ghetto Man, Candy Ghetto Liquor, great. or Mr. Jody. I guarantee you won't be uh, disappointed. Dom, is that it on time? Yes. What, was your first fucking day, dude? That, that's what I mean, that's what I mean you know say. I was thinking. That's what he's going to say. Not yeah, me. I'm going to say that. that. Well, that's been the Bryson <laughs> Sci-Fi Show, everybody. Why don't you edit us with a little, little song or something? A little song? Make up something. A little song? Okay. Uh. It's a little song from Bryce and Sci-Fi. So long. long. See you later. Something. Something's great. (laughs) (laughs) I I set you up to fail on that one. (laughs) It's been fun, everybody. Peace out. I fucking hate Scrappy Doo.